mm-hmm. term plans for fan base? Uh, you, are you looking to to put it into the market? Can we expect an IPO at some point? Where where, where does this where, where does it go for you? I mean, for me, it's about scaling the company. The the the, the uncomfortable part about raising a bunch of money like this mm-hmm. is you have to spend it now. <laughs> you know, the first the first when it was my money, I'm like, mm, I'm being real cautious and careful. But you have to scale a company. And so you have to hire people. We made some great hires. We're making some great, you know, strides. We're adding a lot more functionality. We're really building the company. So it's just about scaling the company. I mean, you're still able to invest. You can still go to startengine.com slash fan base and invest in fan base right now. The minimum to invest is $256. Grab some shares. I know $256 can be a lot to a lot of people, but I know also people that spend $256 on a pair of tennis shoes or they get some Mr. Chow's and chew it up and pee and poop it out. So to be able to take $256 and grab some shares in a company and say, hey man, I forgot about that. Like, yo, that company, that thing just went public or that thing just exited and it's a lot of money there, do that. So my goal is just to make fan base as big as it possibly can be and as disruptive as it possibly can get. Because if you aren't pissing people off, if you aren't shaking the table, you know, proverbially, uh, you're not doing it right. And so I want people to understand that we're here to be disruptive. Uh, how big is your team now? Mm, we are a team of probably 15, right? Is, is this in-house or is this uh, in-house and subcontracted? Yeah, in-house and subcontracted, okay. so yeah. The so core, the core, small. Yeah, the core, the core of the company is really about six people, right? You know, it's myself, my CTO, um, you know, the lead developer, Scrum Master, product, uh, a project coordinator, you know, uh, lead UI, UI UX designer. Like, it's just a small core of people, but um, you know, that's really what what it is in, in the in the people that craft this company. But then. We definitely outsource and we're making some other hires because now we have to build out the marketing side of this company um, and really grow it on that end. I mean, guerrilla marketing is always where I feel like it is, but at some point we're going to have to really step into that marketing lane. And, it, and so when we when we raise the Series A, we'll know we'll do that. But right now we're just going off, you know, guts and 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 what people really feel and the passion we have for the company. And it's, it's proving to be successful. Okay. Um You know, I I asked you that question because people think that you need this huge conglomerate, you know, dozens and dozens of people. Keep your business small. Scale where you need to. Spend your money wisely. Yeah. You spend it in the right places. But you're seeing that you have a core team in-house, six people. I think it's necessary for people to to understand that you can get so much done if you had a small group of dedicated, yeah. truly dedicated people who see the vision. Speaking okay. of seeing the vision, where can I follow you at? And also, I want you to say again where we can go out and invest um, because you have sold me. Uh, mm. You personally, I, I I don't just believe in, in in you know I invest in a lot of companies. I have my my money um, all over the market, but I invest in people as much as I invest in the product. And just yeah. having this conversation with you, um, you you have won me over, and and I am absolutely going to be investing in fan base. Where can Thank we you. find you personally, and where can we go again? And, and invest in the company? Well, the first place you can find me is on Fanbase, right? <laughs> <At ICK's. laughs> no, but, no, because I, I've started to post more of my content on Fanbase than any other social platform, right? I mean, talk about it, be about it. That's where I'm starting to post more of my content. But my social handle is the same on all social social networks. It's at Isaac Hayes 3. So that's, you know, that's, that's Fanbase, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, at Isaac Hayes 3. Um, you can invest in Fanbase at startengine.com slash Fanbase. And I'm going to tell you what's, what, what's key about that and that investment, right? Here's the cheat code. I tell everybody, we can't control the price of Bitcoin. We can't control the price of crypto or Dogecoin. We can't control it, right? But what we can do collectively is invest in a startup like Fanbase, 
move our audience over there, put all of our collective energy in there, and then drive the valuation of that company up. We literally can do that, especially Black culture, right? Anybody can join. As Like I said, we have international expansion on the roadmap for the next couple of months. But the fact that we know that if we move over there, if if, if 20 or 30 of the biggest artists in the game and, and the biggest influences of the game get on fan base, it'll be a billion dollar company by June. Absolutely. And the cool part about it is we can all own a part of it and actually eat on the front end with the monetization, but also on the back end with investment. That's the cheat code. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And we've seen this done a million times. It just yeah. takes one or two high level influencers to do something on fan base and overnight it goes through the roof. We know exactly. that. We know it. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.